Hey guys, my name is Doug with Infotainment.com. Today we're in the 2004 to 2009 Ford Mustang. This is the brick style radio, looks very familiar to most of you. Uh, this comes in several different variations, whether it's a single disc, six disc CD changer, uh, the shaker system, so on and so forth. Um, today I'm going to show you guys how easy it is to upgrade to the Ford 100% Ford factory net GPS navigation system. Um, these are all pre-programmed to your VIN. Uh, we do sell them on our website, infotainment.com. Nevertheless, the tools you will need is just um, a Phillips head bit, 7 millimeter socket, and a dash pry tool. So without further ado, let's get started. First thing we're gonna do is remove these two Phillips head screws. We are underneath the armrest. Next, we're just gonna pop off this little trim here. Set it aside. That'll allow us to just go ahead and remove this whole assembly here. It just pops out of place. Kind of maneuver our way around the stick shift here. We set it aside. Then we can pop off these panels here using our trim pry tool. Where we just kind of just give it a little muscle. On both sides. Both are just held in with retaining clips. That gives us access to the six, seven millimeter screws around the perimeter of the bezel. Once we remove the screws, we can just pop this out of place and disconnect any connectors. The ones behind the climate control are a little tricky. Reset it aside. This little connector here um, is actually seated in position, what you gotta do is push this little black tab in and this lever slides up and that allows you to release it. And then this connector here, you're gonna pull down on this bottom tab here and then it pops out from underneath the bezel. Now what we're gonna do is remove the four seven millimeter screws that hold in the radio. And the radio just slides out. Again, we're gonna disconnect the connectors and set this aside. All right, now what we're gonna to wanna to do is install a few things here. So this is the GPS antenna. This is what is required to get the GPS signal for the radio, the GPS portion. Now this, ideally, you wanna set it anywhere beneath the dash top, just beneath the windshield, with no metal above it. It does have a magnetic background um, or a, um, a base to it, so if you can find a metal bracket or somewhere up under the dash here to put it, that would be ideal. Otherwise, you could put some double-sided tape on it. And as long as you're under the vicinity around here, uh, even just down a little bit, should be okay. If for some reason it's not getting a GPS signal after you in, um, install the radio and you drive around for a minute or two, um, then you can always take it and relocate it. Uh, but you'll find a spot right in here that'll work just fine. Now from 04 to 06 Mustangs, we will include this AM FM antenna adapter. It's really easy. Just plug the factory antenna into one end. And the other end we'll plug in the back of the radio. So now that we have the GPS antenna, and this particular uh, antenna adapter ran. Now, as I mentioned, it's just for 04 to 06. If you have a seven, eight or nine, you will not need this cable. So what we'll do is we'll plug in all the exact same connectors that we unplugged from the original radio, uh, which is this plug here and this plug. Uh, we will plug in the uh, pink FACRA GPS antenna here and then our newly installed uh, AM FM antenna adapter here.
All right, now that everything's plugged in, you'll notice that the screw holes line up perfectly so we can reinstall our four screws. And then you notice the bezel goes back in just like it was before. So we'll reinstall our, our six screws. We'll pop in the panel here. Um, and then we can uh, replace or reinstall our armrest uh, panel here, the center panel. All right, now that we have everything buttoned up and back in its place, let's go ahead and turn it on and take a look. So right away you notice the nice big Ford logo and the nice big touchscreen display. Such a big difference here in this Mustang. As I mentioned, 100% factory Ford um, navigation radio. I also mentioned earlier 100% pre-programmed to the VIN of the vehicle so you don't, do not lose any features. So here on the main screen you have your AM, FM, FM2, SR stands for Sirius. Those of you who would like to add Sirius Satellite Radio, now is a perfect time to do it. It's a tuner that we sell separately, uh, along with an antenna you run, and then it plugs right into the back of the unit, and you're ready to rock and roll. You get um, Sirius Satellite Radio right here on your touchscreen display. Uh, CD refers to the, six, the internal six-disc CD changer. User device is an extra additional cable that we sell that plugs behind the system and it gives you an auxiliary input, which is kind of handy. But yeah, this is your main screen here. You have uh, this button here, your hard key sound. You can adjust your bass and treble, balance and fade. Phone is for those of you who have the 09 and up. Um, those of you who do have the sync system in your 09, which is rare, um, would be able to utilize it through here. Um, Again, some of the systems we sell, uh, this one actually has chrome rings. This one we typically sell to the 07 to 09 vehicles. The ones with the black uh, is typically sold to the 4 to 6. Um, nevertheless, we have uh, the menu feature here. You can adjust your uh, display, the time, system information, so on and so forth. Seek obviously is for your CD or your radio. The map feature here, you press map. Um, it's, it's basically looking for a signal. Um, it looks like it just found us um, through the GPS antenna there. So awesome system here. You don't have, you're not fooling with your phone when you drive. You don't have anything clunky on your windshield. You got the nice big touchscreen navigation system here, which is great. Zoom in, zoom out. Set your destination, whether you want to go to one of them that's in your address book, a point of interest, uh, an address to type in, that's all through destination. The nav key here will allow you to um, set up all the settings for your navigation, how you want it to look, um, avoid areas, toll roads, stuff like that. Um, whenever it is giving you voice prompts to turn left up here and turn right, you can press repeat, which will repeat the last um, prompt. Um, just a great system here. Again, those of you who drive Mustangs, uh, man, what a great what a great upgrade to keep your Mustang nice and factory. You don't have anything clunky or ugly, uh, you, you know, installed in here. This is 100% factory. So ch just a great upgrade. Um, those of you who want to add Bluetooth, this is not Bluetooth ready yet. However, you can buy an aftermarket kit from Parrot or something like that that will integrate with this. We do not have a factory Bluetooth add-on solution yet. Uh, we do have the Sirius Satellite Radio solution. Um, and we also, as I mentioned, have the auxiliary input kit available. So come check us out at infotainment.com. Uh, we will give you more details and other upgrades um, on our advertisement. So come check us out. Thanks for watching, guys.